Good evening and Happy New Year to you all. So this is Cook with Kelly and today we are going to be cooking homemade chips in the air fryer and to go with those we are going to be cooking corn nuggets um, and wraps. So corn nugget wraps. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to peel these potatoes and then I'll be back. Okay, so once you've peeled all your potatoes, you just want to cut them into chip-like shapes. Don't have to be any particular length or it's just roughly cut them. Now, if you're doing um, wedges, then actually you don't have to peel your potatoes. You can just wash your potatoes and just cut up the potato and then you will be doing wedges. So I'm just going to carry on cutting all these up um, and then we'll be going back and showing you um, the air fryer. So there's all our chips. Now what we're going to do, and I'm going to show you, we're just going to move over and we're going to put them into the air fryer. Now these air fryers are, for me, invaluable. We use it every day. You can cook lots of stuff in it. Um, probably the one that we use it for the most is what I'm using it for now. And that is to cook chips. So, guacamole. Like that. This one is a one, um, one kilo one. So, it's the smallest one you can get. But as you can see, you can get quite a few chips in. Now, it depends how much oil you want to use. You can use um, fry light. I do put a bit of oil in. So as you can see, that's all the oil I've used. You can use a lot less than that, still get nice chips. You can use a, you know a bit more and, and get you know more um, oily chips, if that's the right word. So shut down your air fryer and switch it on. So the cooks are chippy. Chi the cook the chips are cooking. And I forgot to say they'll take about 25 to 30 minutes depending on how many you've got in. Now for the wraps, this is what I'm using. Um, chicken nuggets, um, corn, you can get them from pretty much every supermarket. And I challenge anybody to tell the difference between McDonald's nuggets and these. They are exactly the same. So basically, pop these in the oven, um, 15 minutes on about 200 um, and that, they'll be done. Okay, now I'm going to do the wraps, show you how to do the wraps. Now I'm using Weight Watchers wraps for me, and then for everybody else they're just having um, normal wholemeal wraps. Basically I've just put some light mayonnaise on. Oh, and sorry about the noise, that's the air fryer. And I'll show you the chips in a minute. Um, now, sweet chilli sauce. You can get this from most supermarkets and some of them do their own version. It's not expensive. So I'll pop that onto the wrap. Give it a whiz round. Like that. Now you need some iceberg lettuce that I've prepared earlier. And here's your chicken nuggets. Which are now cooked out the oven. Secret with wraps is try and wrap it towards the top so you leave some room at the bottom so when you're wrapping it's a little bit easier. So fold the bottom over first like that and like that. Try and push it in as much as you can without breaking it and then just roll it round. Now when you're eating it you've got to try and hold it so you've got the bottom bit so it doesn't come out when you're biting into it. And there's your wrap. Okay, so we pop that into our plate. Yep. Like that. Yeah. Okay, so there's the wrap. Now we're going to get the chips and I'll pick back up. Okay, so as you can see, you can have a quick look at the top. I'm going to show the viewers the top one. And they look absolutely stunning. So just before um, they were nearly cooked, I put a little bit of salt in, with yep, Christmas salt. 
and salter. So there's our chips. One's escaped. And as you can see, they look absolutely delicious and they taste as good as they look. So now I'm just going to put them with our wrap like that. And there is your homemade chips with um, sweet and yeah. um, I forgot sweet chili wrap and yeah, corn chicken, nug chicken nuggets.